he's a mysterious kind of character. Um, what you see isn't always what you get. And then it turns out it's exactly what you get. <laughs> um, he, he's, uh, he's intelligent and uh, realistic in, in that he totally understands and accepts the world in which he lives. Uh, and which is, you know, in this picture, a dangerous world. He lives among uh, other assassins. Uh, and uh, it, was, it was really fun to play. He's very physical, but he only is physical if he absolutely has to be. He just happens to be pretty good at it. Well, you know, Martin does this as well as anybody, if not better than anybody. You know, if you look at some of his uh, film work, especially his action sequences are just great. And he might be the most organized director I've ever worked with. I've never seen anybody this specifically organized and very clear about what he's shooting, how he's shooting it, why he's shooting it. Maggie Q is something to watch in this movie, man. I mean, she's, you know, she's very pretty and, and it has these scenes where she's quite feminine and then she just beats the shit out of a bunch of guys. And it's really fun to watch. I think little young girls are going to enjoy this a lot. Um, um, and, and it's fun. The action is fun. And she's so good at it. I was lucky to do well over half my, my stunts in there, which is always fun because you when you're a little kid, this is what you want to do. But there was just stuff that there, there are stunt doubles who are just better than I am at doing it. And I'd be a fool not to let them shoot some of those 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 shots better than I can and but when you so there's always something to learn uh, when you're doing stunt work and uh, it's different for almost every movie where I've had to do stunts so what happens is at first it's just a job and it looks like I'm just gonna show up and I've got this well in hand because <clears throat> Rembrandt's done this kind of thing a lot basically gets hired to come in and be the cleanup man um, and do whatever he has to do to make sure the job gets done. So he, he realizes real early because he's very intelligent and his instincts are really good. When he sees some of the damage she's done, he, th he thinks to himself, oh, this is going to be harder for everybody than, than, than they thought. Uh, um, because they kind of think, this will be easy, we'll just take her out. And I realize, nah, they don't realize who they're dealing with. So I'm intrigued by that. Rembrandt is intrigued by that, and then he's, he's attracted to her. And, you know, he can kind of uh, compartmentalize those two things, and then it becomes more and more difficult for him to compartmentalize them, because then he, 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 he'd like to see this thing probably go into, uh, into, another, into another level. Um, you know, so already it's not, it's not a relationship you see a lot in, in movies like this, which made it fun for me.